So we're going to install Cody through Nitto TV on the Apple TV 4. It's going to take a while. Let me pause the video. Okay. This is going to take a little bit. So I'll come back when this is done. Okay, it's done. Now we're going to respring it. This takes a little bit, so I'm going to pause it again. Okay. So now you can see I got Cody. Show you what version I have. It's a 17.0 Alpha 1. This one's pretty outdated. So I'm going to show you guys how to update it to the latest nightly available. First, we need to SSH into the Apple TV. So, we're going to open terminal. Okay. We're going to SSH into the Apple TV 4. As for the password, it's Alpine. Hmm. Okay, there we go. So, first, we need to go to Cody. This is the link, I'll put it in the description. And this is the latest release they have for the nightly. So we're just going to copy the link. First, we're going to put WGET. Hope you guys can see that. And paste that link. Enter. This is going to take a while because it has to download the whole app again. So I'll pause it real quick. Okay, it's done. So now we're going to install it on top of the other one, pretty much replace it. So, Nito. Helper I I'm going to put this in the description also so you come back here to the link and now you just copy the name not the link the name and we're just going to paste it. Let's see what we'll works so wrong. Give me a second. Okay. I was using capital N. Shouldn't be. 
So you put needle helper slash I, and then we're gonna paste not that the name this name right here. Just copy that name. And then this is going to start installing the the new Cody replacing the one we have. This is gonna take a while, so we'll come back. Okay, it's over. So now we're gonna launch it. Actually, we need to restart the Apple TV. Oops. Takes a while. Okay. It's back. Different login. System. Beta 5. Different. Now, we need to delete the file that we downloaded. So, type ls. And we get a list of files that we have on root. Oh, yeah. Kick me out because I restarted. So let's do it again. So this is the list and it's right here so we need to get we need to delete this file so I won't take up all the room okay so you use rm and the entire name of the file, which is the one that we downloaded. Now we check if it got deleted. Second, and it's not there. 